It's difficult to imagine now, but in 1996, when you entered the company, there was quite a bit of, let's say, doubt and speculation as to whether you, coming from a different branch, would be able to lead a company like Mackay. And now, in 2012, there's indeed certain doubt and speculation as to whether a successor can possibly follow on in your footsteps and continue to lead McKay as successfully as you have done over the past 16 years. I think we can safely say in, in wisdom, commitment, intuition, and foresight. Nobody does it better special treatment did not stop here. When they got to the gate, they were both alarmed yet again and once more pulled out for a complete and utter checkover. I believe after this incident, Michael promised Heribert never again to give him his hand in public. <laughs> Shortly after he joined the company, he set up a McKay jogging group to strengthen team spirit and sentiment. He and McKay's leading persona would be up first thing in the morning at seven o'clock, whatever the weather, and go for an hour's jog. Now, of course, for the more conservative thinking executives, this was a totally crazy and, of course, unconventional uh, initiative, <laughs> to say the least. And nevertheless, colleagues admitted that it somehow opened management up to take new paths, creating a fresh new breeze, like a wind of change. And we all wish you, together with your wife Gabrielle, a long, healthy, and satisfying retirement. For what is man? What has he got? If not himself, then he is now to say the thing. Truly feels and not the words of one who kneels. The record shows Harry, but you took the blows. You did. Did it? Hey. 